Five thousand dollars? For me? Can I turn myself in? They got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging them. Here's open. Arthur, what? I really love her. I do. Well, stick around. Maybe you can die for her as well. I thought you were trying to make me feel better. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it. I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> and I didn't kill any of us. Well, I killed some of your relatives. But they would have killed all of us. Hey, who's that? Arthur, you dumbass! You're back. Howdy, Mo Dynamite here, and I'm interrupting y'all to let you know about Amino, which is a mobile network of communities for every interest in the world. Here you can see the Red Dead Redemption 2 Amino. It's full of interesting news, chat rooms, and blogs about the game. If there's anything you want to know about Red Dead 2, you'll find it here. I've just created a poll on there, so come on over and vote. To join the Red Dead 2 Amino, just click the link in the description or pin YouTube comment below which will take you to the download page for Android or iOS. Or you could just search for Amino on your app store and then search for Red Dead Redemption 2 once you're in. And best of all, y'all, it's free. So mosey on down there and say hi to Mo. Now let's go back to Arthur. When I was in the Navy, I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. This time I'll look and you provide the cover. I'll try my best, brother, but I'm seeing double here. That gives you twice the chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. No, but only some huge could do this. Fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Damn, Barry. Think, man. A mind is a terrible thing to lose. Especially over such a nice floor as this. Follow me, gentlemen! Go now! Go! Does this trolley go to Tahiti? You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Do you have the first idea what you're getting into? I'm Anthony Foreman. Well, thanks for the introduction, Anthony. Is that Foreman with an E? I want the Undertaker to spell it right. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. As it passes through a crossroads near here, where there's an old ruined church, before it connects with the rest of the wagon train, very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. Good evening, gentlemen. Arthur Callahan. Sorry I'm late. I had some uh, unfinished business at the bar. Hey, Desmond man. Blythe. Evening. Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> ah, well, at least it ain't your job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. <laughs> well, I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes, you are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> 
Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You have my friend. He's not your friend. I'll give you money. Be quiet. <laughs> You should have taken the money. I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> thank you, I think. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> ow! 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 Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh. <laughs> How did someone even come up with them words? Sie bringen mich zu meiner Familie? Vielen Dank. Wie haben Sie sie gefunden? Look, I'm sorry, friend. I can barely speak English. <laughs>